YTBC What's the Deal. So I just got a chance to watch the Alexander Ustinov fight against Konstantin Erich. Um It was a beatdown. Hopefully Erich is okay. He got hit with a left hook. I wouldn't say so much it was the way that, you know, Ustinov threw the punch. You know, he outweighed Erich by at least about 60 pounds, it looked like. Um, just the mass and the weight just behind the punch. And he landed it flush. You know, like I always say in the heavyweight division, when you have big men, you know, throwing punches at each other, anything can happen. And Erich is way smaller. Uh, he had to have been about 230 pounds, six foot one. He's been brutally beat down in some fights. Um, the Adrian Granat fight, he got stopped. That fight is not on YouTube. I can't find it. But from what I've read, he got brutally stopped in that fight. Anthony Joshua beat down. Um, you know, he's been in some fights, Dennis Boktov, where it's been exciting. But Boktov is a small heavyweight. So, you know, um, he, you know, he's getting beat down fighting these other big heavyweights like this. But hopefully he's okay. Uh, Usinov just used his size, used his reach. When they did clinch, he was able to, to control the clinch just far much bigger than Erich, pushing him back, landing shots, roughing him up. Um, Usinov, you know, I like to see him fight Joseph Parker. I know he was trying to fight Parker at the beginning of the year. A lot of these guys are scared of Joseph Parker. I'm going to do a video about that after this one. Talk about how uh, it seems like Joseph Parker is the new boogeyman of the heavyweight division. Um, but Usinov looked pretty decent tonight. You know, um, he beat Erich, a guy who we should have beat that was there to get beaten. I think Erich, you know, should probably give it up. Uh, I know he likes to get in there. They, You know, he's a journeyman, European level, you know, but getting beat down like this. And he was down for a few minutes, man. After that, he got caught with that hook towards the end of the fifth round. But Yusinov, I like to see him there, you know, with the Joseph Parker. Uh, Andy Ruiz Jr., somebody like that, a Marius Watch, uh, you know, uh, Hellenius. Somebody like that. You know, he's beat David Tua. But if you look at the guys he's beaten, Dennis Boktov, Jason Gavern, Monty Barrett. I mean, these guys, you know, guys you've heard of, right? Journeyman that all the other contenders have fought. Um, Maurice Harris, you've seen Harris in there with uh, Pulev and Mansoor. So, want to see Yusinov in there with the top 30 guy. Jarek Jide, anybody. If they want to throw Granat in there early. If you want to put him in there with Derek Chisora, who just won today also. Who did Chisora beat today? Um, I thought I had it written down. Chisora beat Jacob Gospick today. And then last week he beat Peter Erdos. So he's been active trying to rebuild himself after that uh, loss to Tyson Fury in the rematch. But I want to see Yusinov in there with somebody that will give him a go. He is a big guy, man. Six foot eight, two hundred and ninety pounds. He's thirty nine years old. Won't worry about. I won't worry about his age, being that, you know, like I always tell you guys, you go look at box rec. The top twenty heavyweights, ten of them are thirty four years or older. So, thirty nine is not that old. He has size. YTBC. I'm out.